Hi guys, so today I'm going to watch a new video. It's actually a movie clip. I'm going to watch a movie clip from a movie called 1984. Okay, it is actually a British dystopian science fiction film written and directed by Michael Radford based upon George Orwell's novel of the same name and uh, the movie is starring John Hurd, Richard Burton, Susanna Hamilton and Cyril Kazak. The film follows the life of uh, Winston Smith, a law-ranking civil servant in one tone London ruled by Oshania, a total a totalitarian super stage and Smith struggles to maintain his sanity and his grip on reality as the regime's overwhelming power and influence persecutes individualism and individual thinking on both a political and personal level. So it's a quite interesting movie. It is, you know, it's actually a little intense movie and I'm watching one of uh, one of the uh, clips from the movie called Room 101 and people telling me that it's actually very uh, very intense you know very very intense yeah that's the word right very intense and very terrifying scene and so that's why I'm so a little bit curious so I did some more research on that um, some more research on that and find out that Room 101 introduced in the climax of the novel or the movie is the basement torture chamber in the ministry of love <laughs> and ministry of love basically the government in charge of the armed force mostly in the navy and army and basically in which the party attempts to subject a prisoner to his or her own worst nightmare fear or phobia with the object of breaking down their resistance wow so <laughs> without any further ado let's go and check out that that crazy crazy chamber scene okay it's going to be it's going to be terrifying let's go okay you've not asked me the question that is uppermost in your mind Winston. you know what is in your mind you know everyone knows what's in your uh -huh. Room 101 The Death Chamber Everyone knows what's in the room 101 <laughs> I love the way he <laughs> did the dialogue There is that chamber, the death chamber. You asked me once, Winston, what was in room 101. Okay. I told you that you knew already. Oh. Everyone knows. The thing that is in room 101 is the worst thing in the world. It's the worst thing in the world. It goes beyond fear of pain or of death. It is unendurable and it varies from individual to individual. It may be burial alive or castration or any other thing. In your case, it is rats. You will do what is required of you. <laughs> what is it? Rats. How can I do it? I don't want to be. In the proletarian areas, they will attack a baby and within five minutes strip it to the bone. They also attack the sick and dying. They show astonishing intelligence in knowing when a human being is helpless. Please. 
mask fits over your head, leaving no exit. I press the first lever, and the rats move into the front compartment. I press the second, and the door of the cage will slide up. These starving brutes will shoot at you like bullets. Have you ever seen a rat leap through the air? Wow. They will leap onto your face and bore straight into it. Sometimes they attack the eyes first. Sometimes they burrow through the cheeks and devour the tongue. When someone is dying, that crazy girl is saying, I love you. What a timing, right? <laughs> Man. This... This, this death, you know, crazy, you know, this death, crazy chambers are always, you know, frightening, right? Ah, who would have thought some rats is that scary, right? Who would have thought that? Ah, it just, it's just crazy, man. Just, just so crazy. That's a crazy scene, of course. And, you know, when I, uh, when I look at that comment section, you know, a lot of people saying that, you know, the scene in the novel is much better. You know, when you, when you read the, when you read in the novel, it is much better. So I don't know about that, but, you know, in this scene, when I'm watching this scene, it looks pretty scary to me. So I don't know how much more frightening this scene is in the novel. So I'm curious about that. Maybe maybe I should check out the novel. I don't know. But man, the scene from the movie. Ah, you don't you don't want that to happen, right? You don't want to. You don't want that to happen. 